This is just gonna be so bad. <laughs> Yo, what is up everybody? I'm Mommy Yoshiko. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back to my channel, motherfucker! So a long, long time ago on YouTube, there was a trend. And as usual, I am like the last person <laughs> to freaking hop on these trends because one, I'm lazy. Two, I don't think of an idea until like months after, until everyone has already done it. But I did it. And that's all that matters, right? Nope, no, yeah, that's stupid. Mm, okay. A long, long time ago, I remember seeing a bunch of YouTubers, I'll put some thumbnails here. I saw a bunch of videos of YouTubers trying one-star locations, going to a one-star hotel, one-star nail salons, one-star tattoo shops, and I was like, how about one-star Amazon cosplays? But I decided, why not make this a fun video? So I went on Amazon and I bought several different one-star cosplay costumes and wigs, and we are gonna try it out today. It was actually kind of hard to find like one star cosplay items which is actually pretty interesting from highest to lowest star there wasn't any lowest rating to the highest rating so it took a lot of freaking searching like i was literally on amazon for hours going back and forth all the filters find one star items quicker and i finally found several wigs and costumes that were one star so here's all the shit and let's get into it i probably should have opened all this stuff beforehand but um, that's what smart people do that's not me though so the first set of cosplays and wig I bought was from Boku no Hero Academy, and I bought the training suit. I have one already for like my female Bakugo, which I will do eventually when I feel like it. And that one is really good. It's good material, it's easy to breathe, and it like feels like actual gym clothes. And I found a one star Boku no Hero training outfit. Which is funny because with this one, I remember it saying it was one star. But then when I clicked on the actual product, the one star was gone. I also like looked on Google like how to find one star reviews, but all I found were results on how to get rid of one star reviews on your Amazon. So I'm assuming that the seller or whatever deleted it, but for some reason it might still show up when you look up the item. Fucking figurative, um, um, don't sue me. And I also bought a wig of one of the characters to like make this a set, and I actually found a one star wig of the character, and I was like, I love Amazon. I love Amazon for wigs and costumes. Like, this is in no way me trying to shit on Amazon. I love Amazon. My freaking amazing Junko cosplay was all from Amazon. In my opinion, Amazon is one of the best savers for time and shit for cosplay. And I bought the wig of Himiko Toga. So let's see if this will be a failed cost test. Oh, that's so cute. They come with keychains. How, how are you one star? They came with keychains, how cute. Like they come with keychains. Excuse you. Wow. You can't see nothing. Like freaking Uraka or some shit. It's not that bad. Oh shit, okay. <laughs> see, one problem I always have with cosplays is like my hips are really big. So even if it fits my chest and my waist, the hip part, it will not do. Fuck yeah, no. It's not bad. Like it doesn't look bad. Like mine, it's in my room. Like the material is very, is more breathable. I wouldn't rate this a one. I'd rate this like a three, a two. Like the color is decent and this is just like ribbon, which is what they use for a lot of cosplays you get like from China and eBay, no shade, just facts. Ugh, I don't like it. Ugh. And the zipper is pretty secure. Why would someone rate this a one? Well, one, okay. These look fun. And I, I can tell already because, you know, I used to make a lot of my cosplays back when I was into cosplaying more. Basic suit material. Very thin. Not very breathable. This, this is like what they make of the schoolgirl uniforms. Because when you buy cosplays on eBay and stuff, you notice they use like the same freaking fabric for everything. <laughs> so far, fit is okay. A little tight, but I have my other sweatpants underneath. But if anything, I, I wouldn't rate this a one at all. Whoever was freaking complaining. And next we have the freaking wig for Himiko Toga. This wig was also rated one star but they came with a wig cap that's already a plus in my book because i know you're buying the wig but what i get so mad at is when i buy a wig and there's no wig cap i'm like excuse you sir i paid for greatness and i expect greatness 
Uh, okay, yep, that is, this is cheap Chinese material. But you know with wigs, you kind of get what you pay for. And I'm not gonna cut this cause I don't plan on keeping this. Yes, I know, my eyebrows are not ideal. Wig hair is already shedding, we're off to a great start. Ugh, excuse you. This ain't it, sis. This ain't it. See, I have a an Art of Wigs one. Like when you feel like this feels like straight up plastic. This feels more dry like hair would be. I, you can't even see my face when I'm talking to you. Holy crap. Here are the little buns she has. But, the fuck, how do you even? What is this? I know most wigs have this. This just looks stupid. Like it looks like the image. Not really? One, the color is not it. Like the color, it looks more like my Bakugo wig. But this one just looks straight up yellow. Not even blonde, yellow. I appreciate the bangs that are kind of already pre-cut, but this ain't toga. This ain't it, sis. <sighs> now I just look like some prehubescent scene kid. So the wig, it's a nah for me, fam. It's a no for me. The freaking wig color isn't even accurate to the picture. And it's just not right. It's, it's not right. Are these even buns? What is this? It just looks like a freaking rat. Not even blonde, like a very badly bleached yellow that didn't get toned properly. And now it looks like that. And the next costume, the wig and the outfit, Jessie from Team Rocket. I'm like almost embarrassed to put on. Look at this. Just look at it. This looks ridiculous. And why am I going to put it on me? This just looks like straight up party city shit. Like, this is just horrible. Oh, and it doesn't come with a wig cap. See, look at this is huge. I can literally, what the, why is it so big? And this costume is supposedly licensed by Pokemon. To think, first of all, ugh, it smells so bad. It smells like tire? It, this wig smells like a tire store. Oh my. Ridiculous, holy fuck, holy crap. It looks like I just put cellophane, like those twisty ribbon things from the party store on my head. That freaking lace front though, I'm kidding, this looks horrible. See, like, what? What are you supposed to do with this? Now, for the, for the dreaded costume. I'm not gonna be happy about this at all. This is ridiculous, I just look lame. This literally looks like the bullshit skirts you get from Forever 21, but they actually work. It comes with gloves. Oh, they shouldn't have. <laughs> Ew. Ew. There's hair everywhere. I hate it so much. This is so itchy. Oh my god, this is so itchy. Basic Party City gloves. This is disastrous. I don't even want to try on the freaking skirting crap because then I'm going to have to take off these two layers of pants. I will give it like a one because it comes with everything. This wasn't a cheap costume. It comes with like straps. I just fucking broke it. I just snapped it. Holy crap. This is bullshit. They should be fired. Prepare for travel. This is stupid. I'm gonna take this off because this is just so bad. I love Jesse from Team Rocket. Yeah, they're evil, but this costume, did, oh, it's so fucking itchy. Oh my God, Ugh, it feels so itchy and it feels so gross. Have you ever like put on something that just made you feel so gross? <laughs> like when you see a bug, like that's how I feel right now. It feels disgusting. This one gets a negative five. The worst costume I've ever put on my body. I was even telling myself, this costume sucks. It's ugly and I could buy the freaking pictures. It looks bad. The Jessie costume, negative 20 bajillion. Never again. Rubies on Amazon, 
don't know her, don't wanna hear her, don't wanna see her, no. And now for the last one star item I bought is, the picture kinda looked like pop star Ari, and in the picture it looks very cute, very pretty, but we have it here, so let's see. Let's see what the T here is. The color doesn't even look like the image at all. Oh, it does, it came with the cat ears, that's one. Oh, mama, this ain't gonna be good. Okay, the material itself feels better. Feels better from that freaking Team Rocket wig. It has a scalp, and it's, this one isn't bad. It's thick, a little shedding, but that's normal. I mean, you get what you pay for with these things. It's heavy, this has a lot of hair. Whoa. How is this supposed to be parted? Did I ruin it? I think I ruined it. See, this wig already gets like a two or a three just cause it's our, it's really thick. And it's not like incredibly plasticky. Wow. A one? Who the hell rated this a one? Look it, it's thick. Ooh shit. Mm. This is like a panty from panty and stocking moment. It might not suit my skin tone, but this isn't a one? Who freaking rated this a one? On its own, this is a four out of five Amazon wig. I would even say five out of five compared to all the other qualities of Amazon wigs that are out there. Some of them really suck without even moving it. You could like see the freaking head cap, but this one, no, this one. This one's not bad. It came with ears. These are actually kind of cute. Like see, the bangs are obviously too long, but that's cause mama has to cut them. You have to style. Yeah, see, even when you part it, it's not even that bad. Yeah. Wow. I need to get this one on better. Ah! I used to play League of Legends, but I would be tired of everyone yelling at me to stop feeding. Try to do that. Wow. See, this one, no, this isn't a one. This is like a solid three for an Ari wig, cause what the fuck are these ears? This one I can't really figure out. I don't know. Okay, better. Wow, I would give this one a three for an Ari wig, but for like, a, if you're looking for just like a blonde wig, I'd give this a four. But anyone can have different experiences on Amazon. But um, I hope y'all enjoyed this me trying one star Amazon cosplay costume wigs. If you want me to do this again, leave it in the comments below, or if you find any that are one star, let me know and I will do them. This showstopper is Bloody Shiki. Thank you so much, Boo, for all your love and support. It means the world to me. Thank you. Let me know any of your Amazon stories. Have you had any horror Amazon cosplay costume stories? Or have you genuinely had a decent experience? I've always had a decent experience with Amazon. I actually really liked the Boku Note Hero outfit. I probably should have ordered a size up for my hips. But in general, that one's not bad. And you get free and you get keychains. Who doesn't like some free keychains? A friggin' lame-o. That too. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for for joining my weeb family. I love you very much and I'll see you next time. Bye.